were some good films. There was. Um, and I love, uh, I'm a 90s, like 90s at heart, you know what I'm saying? The 90s is what raised me. Um, and the 90s always reminds me um, of going to Blockbuster on a Friday and walking down the aisles looking for the the new releases and whatever movies was out there. And I remember seeing in the horror section, you see them tapes in there or whatever and see all of those like creepy uh, creepy, like, because all the movies are always there, like, all the random ones. What? Blake, what is the movie of the 90s that you think is the best? Matter of fact, what is your best 90s horror movie and your worst 90s horror film? What you got? Uh, 90s. 90s were good, man. Not just for music, but for horror movies as well. Best and worst. Um... I don't know if I can think about what the I don't know if I can think about what the worst was, but I can definitely say overall, I I would have to say the one that really like stood out is Scream. Mm. Um, Scream was something that we hadn't seen before. It was new, but you could believe everything that was kind of taking place. That there could be a serial serial killer out there that was just that confused and just sucked into horror movies to do things. The kills made sense. Everything that happened was from like human people. Yeah, there's some, you know, obviously, you know, horror movie stuff. But all in all, I think that that was, I really liked Scream. I thought Scream was a good, good start as to what the best was. Worst. Worst. There's a lot. There's a lot. I'll come back to you. <laughs> like, we'll come back to you. Um, Brie, what about you? What is um, your best and worst of the 90s? I want to get my worst out of the way right now. Oh, it's geez. called The Haunting. You ever heard of that? Yes. Oh, yeah. You know what? yeah. So it's like, like what is it? Catherine Zeta Jones is in it. I think yeah. Liam Nielsen's in it. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. What's her name? I forgot her that last girl name. girl on The Conjuring. The chick yeah, the, on The Conjuring. Not, yeah, and yeah, I the hated her until she did The Conjuring, and now I like her again. <laughs> but I hated Ooh, her for that movie. Yeah, the mom. That movie was just oh. the worst horror movie ever. I went and saw in the theater with my friend, I think, like, I don't know, like high school, college, and I'm, that movie was just bad. I'm like, what a waste of time. <laughs> what a waste oh, of Owen time. Wilson was in it, too. Yeah, a bunch, there was all these famous people, so I thought it was going to be great. It was so bad. Don't even waste your time looking it up. If anybody Better than the it. house on Haunted Hill. <laughs> no, is that what I'm talking about? No, 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 no. No, no, it's The Haunting. It's The Haunting. You're right on The Haunting. The Haunting was bad, too. To me, that's whatever. Yeah. Owen Wilson. Hey, Diggs movie. Yes. <laughs> that one was trash. That was bad, too. <laughs> Which one was that one? That was The House on Haunted Hill? That's The House on Haunted Hill. That was with, yeah. um, who is that guy? There was a bunch of famous people in that, too. Um, mm -hmm. uh, God, who is it? Uh, there's yeah. a bunch of famous people in that movie. And it's like, they had to escape, and they're like dying room by room. Yeah. And somehow at the end, what is it? Uh, Tay Diggs is like on a roof with a lady. Yeah, none of it. Was it weird. Made, and all they couldn't figure out how they were home. That was the end of the movie. I'm like, yeah, there was like weird. A lot of people moving really fast. Yeah, it was, it was bad. So. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's right. They did do that little shaking thing that yeah. was real fast. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, that wasn't terrible. Well, what's your best then, Brie? My what's best on a health is trainer? Seven with Brad Pitt. Ooh. Mm, that's a good one. Because that movie was so freaking dark. It was the first time what's I in the box. Yeah, like it was just so gritty and grimy and like you can see like they're trying to solve this case, but you can see it like slowly taking over their souls. You know what I mean? Yes. And the end, I mean, you can't top that ending. I mean, what's in the box? Like you said, what's in the Absolutely. box? You don't want to know. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> so... People are still like dealing with that. That like, movie was traumatizing. Uh, like, yeah, <laughs> for sure, for sure. Okay, I don't. Okay, yeah, I think you you're on the right track there. You're on the right track. I didn't hate the haunting that much, uh, <laughs> I but hate it. you know, I mean, yeah. I like House on Haunted Hill better. They kind of came out at the same time. You like the House on Haunted Hill better? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> don't judge uh, me. Guys, you don't even know what your worst is, so you don't know. I, 
<laughs> do oh, you man. know Troy? Do you know what is? Yeah, my my mind? best of the '90s is Silence of the Lambs. Ah, for me. that uh, even as a kid, you know, like Hannibal the Cannibal and you know Buffalo Bill, all that stuff. Yeah, really uh, scared me, especially coming out as a kid from the '80s, coming out of the whole Night Stalker, Ted Bundy era type stuff. And just to think of, you know, the things going on in that movie that could be real life, uh, that really scared me as a kid. And I really love it as a movie because I think that, you know, the acting is great. The the atmosphere that they set in the movie is great. Uh, the writing is great. I, I really love Silence of the Lambs. I could watch that anytime. Uh, my worst, and, you know, I don't know. I, I don't like that movie, Leprechaun. <laughs> Everybody is always like, oh, you know, and Leprechaun's pretty good. I'm just like... I, I don't get it on any level. Like it's trash to me. Like on every level. And so even in space. Even yeah, in oh space. Oh my God. On even space, in space. space, in the ocean, on earth, wherever. It's bad. In the hood, driving. Mm -hmm. Exactly. In the hood. Yeah. So leprechaun is my worst for sure. Well, you know, I don't think anybody can argue with you on that. Even just coming out of your mouth and saying the Leprechaun is the worst <laughs> horror movie ever. Yeah, I mean, like, it sounds it's like, like part of your childhood. Yeah. Like that's just like a classic. <laughs> you know what? I think that's I think that's why we give so many bad movies a pass. Like I was talking about earlier, like oh, you know, uh, Friday the Thirteenth, dude, it's terrible, but we love it so much because it's a part of our childhood. The yeah. original things that scared us. We have leprechauns on our cereal boxes. Like, I mean, oh god, it's me and the charms. Yeah, there's a lot yeah. of really good. There's a lot of really good movies in the nineties. I know, and I will say, like my, looking at it, my it about, I know what you did last summer. Anaconda. Yeah. Arachnophobia. No, oh no. yeah, arachnophobia was good. Yeah. You know what my favorite is? My favorite in the nineties was Candyman. Oh um, yeah. 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 Candy but which one though? Which one? The first, the first one. Okay. Because look, it's, it's fair work to the flesh part two. Yes. Yeah. Because I, I, I didn't. I, I like part two as well. I, I like both of them. They're. Both I like both of them too. Uh, yeah. But that uh, Day of the Dead part three. Mm -mm. Don't do that one. Um, but um, Candyman was for me because I remember when that came out, and I remember we had just got. Uh, a new big screen TV so before the flat screens and stuff. We had that big, big screen, whatever. And the sound system was like impeccable. Oh, uh, and bigger than what we had ever had. So when you watch Candyman, his voice in the sound system, uh -huh. yeah, it sounded yeah. like, I mean, it sounded something different to where that legit like scared me for a long time. And I was not like a little, little kid whenever this movie, right. but yeah. just connecting that story with just like, his voice and just in the times, like whatever it is, like when I think of nineties, like scary movie, like that scared me, that's the best one for me. Was I agree. And I think Candyman has one of the best voices in horror. Yeah. Like I got that's Candyman and, and, and Jigsaw to me. Like those two voices are like awesome for yeah. like, as far as horror movies. Yeah, yeah. It was just like, be my victim. Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah. In the background. Yeah, yeah. The score, just the music in that one, just like everything about that one, just like really, like, that's the 90s. Now, the yeah. worst. Now, I talk about the worst, like walking down uh, the aisle in Blockbuster and you're seeing all of the movie cases and all the me movies or whatever, and there's nothing worse than uh, a some graphic art or whatever the little poster is on the front of the cover not being truly a representative of what the movie is and the worst one of that is Jack Frost oh. uh, <laughs> cover of that makes him look terrifying and you're like oh wow this is gonna be horrifying this snowman killer snowman looks like he means business this is demonic and terrifying and then you watch that thing and it's literally a snowman like walking around like poorly it's the worst it's like not even close and you're like what? And, oh it's it's terrible and you're like why did they even do that like how do they have it to where it's like it's 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 bad it's the worst it is the worst to me and 
Blake, I don't know if you agree with me or not because I know how much. Oh you yeah, know. it's blatant. Uh, uh, false advertising. Because <laughs> you see yeah. the cover, and you're like, you're like, oh, like okay, and then just when you just see a little bit of, it, you're like, this is made by like, did you just got this from a store and you knew that you could only buy one, so we had to make sure that the eyebrows could come up and go <laughs> this way and that way to make them look mad, and that's yeah. just that's it. It's, oh man. It's ridiculous. Everything about that movie is terrible, though. It's, it's bad. pretty bad. It's pretty bad. To it's where also you, supposed to be bad, though. So. But here's the deal, though. And I can I can appreciate supposed to be bad films, but this one I don't think was supposed to be as bad as it was. How bad it was. I've never I seen that, that movie. Don't. You're not it, but I haven't seen the movie, so maybe you I'll don't take just it. <laughs> you, you don't need to. Okay, we just told you. we just told you. <laughs> I said. Who's out there? Well, it ain't fucking Frosty! Just... Oh, 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 are you? We're Old's most pissed off snow cone! No, no! It's a long drive!